They say every dog has its own day. And behind every successful person, there's a story where he started from. President William Ruto knows what it would take to be the next president of this country. He mastered the game of politics. With 10 years of being the second in command of this country, Ruto knew all the loopholes that he needed to seal in order for him to win the presidency. Ruto was exposed to a lot that remains a misery till date. The deep state, as they say, was the golden key to the house on the hill, State House, Nairobi. The fallout between Ruto and his then boss, retired President Uhuru Kenyatta, came when the former head of state was serving his last term. This was an added advantage to Ruto at that time when Uhuru was busy parading Raila as his preferred successor. Ruto knew that was the perfect time for him to seal all the loopholes he needed to win the much anticipated one-sided presidential race that would have that would have rocked the nation in years, a political son and father, respectively. The so-called deep state that had Raila Odinga's backing, Ruto had already mastered and strategized it. It wasn't a game of chances for Ruto. It was for Raila. He knew already that he had already won the presidency. Little did Uhuru and his preferred candidate Raila Odinga knew Ruto would beat them at their own game. Ruto became the fifth president of this country, leaving Uhuru stating that he had to follow the constitution and the rule of law by handing over power respectfully to his small boss. But at the end,